So, the League of Nations. Porridge on my head at five in the morning. So the League of Nations was set up to keep world peace. To improve working conditions, to be humanitarian. To make the world a better place but its main purpose was world peace the fact that we had world war two indicates that the league of nations didn't really succeed in keeping world peace or keeping armaments down the idea came from the americans it came about at the end of world war one It was more successful, relatively with humanitarian missions, in the 1920s. It failed in its fundamental mission to keep world peace. World War II is evidence of this. It had a credibility problem from the start. America, whose baby it was, Woodrow Wilson, didn't join. The League's credibility waned. If it had any credibility, it waned and completely disappeared rather quickly. The League was okay to deal with smaller, more compliant countries, but it didn't deal with more powerful ones because its leaders were self-interested. The USSR, although a member, was a victim of um, what you might call aggression. It was very unpopular with the leadership of the West and it was attacked many times and this was seen as okay. An example, you need examples. Japan, for example, when they invaded Manchuria, the League sent one man, an old man, Lord Lytton, to investigate. It took him one year to get there. Oh. no army and no real interest and it's their own empires to run the lead members of the League of Nations were not going to enforce the rules of the organization
a victim of um, what you might call aggression. It was very unpopular with the leadership of the West and it was attacked many times and this was seen as okay. Italy, for example. Britain and France were trying to keep Italy on side and out of uh, an alliance with Germany. and so allowed Mussolini to do what he wanted. There was a huge issue of respect, credibility and respect. Um, Fritz of Nansen. He was a person who did um, huge successful humanitarian efforts in getting over 500,000 prisoners of war home. Fantastic for these prisoners of war. But in the end, World War II broke out. led to many, many more deaths and many more prisoners of war. Japan, Italy, Germany. Look at that. They did not respect the League of Nations, did not fear the League of Nations, and were not willing to obey the League of Nations. Porridge, stop messing around, sweetheart. This is serious. She doesn't she doesn't respect the League of Nations. Babes. She does not respect the League of Nations. This was a fundamental problem. And probably the League members of the League of Nations didn't respect the League of Nations. So why respect them, the Japanese would ask. Oh
all in all, if the League of Nations couldn't stand up to aggression for whatever reason, then nations, especially when you think that during the Depression, the Great Depression, countries were poor and for their own economies to succeed, they were looking to expand, to get resources. This is particularly true of Japan, who invaded Manchuria in 1931. The Great Depression had an enormous effect. It wasn't as though the League of Nations was functioning very well anyway. It had structural weaknesses, it had credibility crises, and the Great Depression it was the catalyst really, the, the, the catalyst you like that, you like that Poznan the catalyst that really put the boot in that really shook the League of Nations and proved that it was apart from its humanitarian functions its commissions, its agencies, it was pretty useless. So while it wasn't a total failure, it was a fundamental failure. So, League of Nations failed in its main purpose, which was to keep peace. It did have some humanitarian successes. It showed itself to be self-interested and it failed to really stand up to any challenges in the 1920s, which were the seed of its absolute failures in the 1930s. However, it was relatively more successful in the 1920s than it was in the 1930s when it had so obviously collapsed. And you need to know the reasons for its weaknesses. So how successful was it? Why was it weak? Point, evidence, explanation, link, system. Done. Finished. Oh, this is difficult. This is difficult. She's nicked my hat. Porridge has nicked my hat. I can't remember what I was trying to say. Ow. Ow. Wow, that's really quite painful. You've got little baby claws.